Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to show how to find the value of x where square root of x plus 2 times square root of x is equal to 1 or taking a square to both side we can write a square root of this x plus this 2 times a square root of x whole square is equal to right side is 1 square or this square root and this square will cancel out so it will be x plus this 2 times square root of x is equal to right side 1 square this is 1 or taking this x to right side we will have 2 times square root of x is equal to right side 1 minus this x or taking a square to both side again we can write 2 times a square root of x whole square is equal to right side 1 minus x whole square or this 2 square this is 4 and this square root and this square will cancel so it will be x is equal to applying formula a minus b whole square is equal to a square minus twice a b plus b square to right side we can write 1 square minus 2 times this 1 times this x this is twice a b plus b square means this x square or left side 4x is equal to this 1 square is 1 minus this 2 times x times 1 this is twice x plus right side is x square or taking this right side to left we can write 4x minus this 1 and this negative twice x will be positive twice x and this positive x square it will be negative x square is equal to 0 or this negative x square negative x square and 4x plus 2x this is plus 6x and this minus 1 is equal to 0. Now taking common negative 1 from left side we can write negative of this x square it will be negative 6x and taking common negative 1 so that it will it will be positive 1 is equal to 0. Now if we multiply both side by negative 1 it will remain x square minus 6x plus 1 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation the general quadratic equation is a x square plus b x plus c is equal to 0 and the solution of this equation x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of 
b square minus 4 times c a over twice a. Now comparing to this equation the value of a is equal to the coefficient of x square which is 1 and b this is the coefficient of x so this is negative 6 and this c is equal to the constant term so this is positive 1. So applying this formula we can write x is equal to negative b means negative of b is negative 6 plus or minus square root of b square means negative 6 square minus 4 times c times a this c is 1 and a is 1 and all over twice a this is 2 times the value of a is equal to 1 or this x is equal to negative of negative 6 this is positive 6 plus or minus square root of negative 6 square is 36 36 and 4 times 1 this is 4 and times 1 is 4 so it will be negative 4 over this 2 times 1 this is 2 or this x is equal to this 6 plus or minus 36 minus 4 this is 32 so it will be a square root of 32 all over this 2 or the value of x is equal to this 6 plus or minus 32 this can be written as 16 times 2 this is 32 and this is square root divided by this 2 or this x is equal to this 6 plus or minus square root of 16 this is 4 and this square root of 2 divided by this 2 so the value of x is equal to this 6 divided by 2 this is 3 and plus or minus plus or minus 4 divided by 2 this is 2 times this square root of 2 so this is the solution of our given equation if you like this video please subscribe my channel thanks for watching